Hey YouTube, so today I'm going to be doing another um, first impression on a, on a foundation. It's going to be the Instant Age Rewind Eraser Treatment Makeup. And this is how it looks. And it is from Maybelline. So this is it. I did another first impression on the um, Fit Me Stick foundation. Um, if you want to see that tutorial, just click here. And if you're on your phone and you can't see the link up here, then just click down on the um, description bar down below. So this is brand new. I'm opening it. Dun, 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 dun. And it is in Honey. 320 Honey. So it comes like this. And I'm not sure how to use it or twist it. Okay. So I can twist it. Oh. Up here. Oh. Just like that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use a sponge. I think I'm just going to use my foundation stick. This one. So let's just twist it up. So this is how it is. You just twist it and I guess the foundation comes off. And I'm just going to apply. And put it to your face. So I'm going to do half of my face. I should have did that yesterday. I kind of like the sponge. Um... I don't know. I don't know if I should use it or not. <laughs> I'm like tempted. Okay. Let's just use it. Work it in there. Ah. So it's kind of like a wet formula. I'm going to get my lips too, just so when I put lipstick on, it's good. Hold on, I'm, I'm doing something. Go ahead, go over there. Okay, go over there. Okay, now I'm just going to blend it out with the foundation brush. Hmm. A little bit more under my eyes. Okay. So you tell me if you can see a difference. Um, I definitely, definitely do. It covered a lot of my freckles that I have on my. Okay, sorry, keep getting interrupted, but. Um, like I said, I can see the difference in how much it covered my face. Um, yeah, it looks like it works really good. It covered a lot of my dark circles under my eyes. Um, it doesn't look like it's dry yet. It feels kind of moist still. But I like how it covered my freckles. I have a lot of freckles right here. You can see them on this side too. And um, I have red, 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 red cheeks all the time. And um, a little bit of purple underneath. So it definitely covered all of that on this side. So I'm very, very impress impressed so far. So let me just finish my face. So wind and apply.
Okay, so this is the final result. Um, I just uh, darkened my eyes a little bit and just put on a nude lip. And, uh, yeah, um, I somewhat like it. Uh, I don't have any complaints about it yet. Uh, it dried pretty quick. Um, it concealed, um, 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 my bad. It concealed a lot underneath my eyes. Uh, there I go again. Uh, it, it looks very good so far. I like it. I don't know. You tell me what you think. I put on some blush and, um, I like how it looks so far. It looks like it covered pretty good. I like how it's really convenient because it's just, again, like a little stick and you just swab it on. There's no pump and then you're having to put it all over your face. It's just twist up and then dun, 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 you know and I kind of used the sponge a little uh, kind of didn't like it kind of did I feel like to blend it out better you need like a foundation stick or you can even use your um, sponge so yeah I'll keep you guys updated throughout the day and I'll try my hardest to do at least two um, recordings of how it looks in the sun and how it looks and how it's going so far for me but so far so good so let's see if it's better than my favorite um the cover girl at last day fabulous i love this one cover girl you know what you're doing so let's try the maybelline and see if the maybelline works even better so so far so good so i'll keep you guys continue i'll keep you i'll keep you guys updated okay so whoop, whoop. here we go yeah Seems like it's still covered up pretty well. We'll see throughout the day. Legs, 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 legs. I came in in like a wrecking ball. Just kidding. And if I don't, the foundation it looks like it's keeping up very well. Nothing on my fingers. So that's good. So it dried. Nothing around my nose or, um, underneath my eyes like I said and um it didn't make me oily at all so that's a plus 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 so I'm really liking it so far um it is 624 let's see focus <laughs> well I will keep you updated until I go Mimi's so so far so good Mommy. hey guys so I'm back so it's end of the day and the makeup held well the foundation held up very well I just took off my eye makeup, and, um, yeah, I think it concealed under my face pretty well. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I think it covered pretty good. What I didn't like, um, is that, um, it was just, I don't know, kind of oily, I guess, a little bit. It took quite a while for it to dry. I feel like with the CoverGirl 3-in-1, I feel like it dries very quick, um, I don't know. Maybe if I would have said it with some powder or something, it would have been different. But I liked it, um, so I would get the, I would give that an eight out of a ten. So it worked very good for me, and yeah, that's my review on it. Um, I don't know what do you guys think. Do you guys like that foundation? Um, let me know in the comments down below if you've tried it. If it's your favorite, tell me what your favorite foundation is. Maybe I can try it. Um, but yeah. And I forgot to announce the winner. I thought I put it in my other video, but I didn't. So I will we'll put her name right here. So congratulations. And for my other subbies, the mail that I sent out to them, um, two were international, so those are going to take quite a while. And the other ones, I think that you guys should have received them already. Um, I'm not sure. I didn't put tracking on them. I put tracking on one package, and that's just because um, it was an e-cigarette. So, yeah. So yeah, other than that, um, thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a good night.